Assalamualaikum guys and welcome to Budak Harias channel So today we got some we got something else to show I mean that uh, these few days I've been doing like a lot of customs and, and, and such So yeah I might have to change it a bit Because uh, I'm still waiting for some decals and uh, some other stuff as well Such as sprays and primer and all those sort of stuff So yeah I mean like today uh yeah, I'm trying uh, I'm trying to do like, uh, some of my videos in English I mean because some I think some of my viewers uh, do watch my do really want me to uh, speak or talk about my channel or my videos about uh, in English so yeah that's what I'm gonna do from now on I mean like, some of it's gonna be in English and some of it's gonna be in Malay so yeah so just bear with me with uh, with some of the videos that I don't really speak in English and some of the videos where I just talk in English not Malay so yes I just I uh, just want to really clarify the that problem for now so yeah today I have this the infamous uh, Nisa Scanner R34 for the mainline for 2019 I think this one is in the I think it should be somewhere in the B case or C case I don't really remember but yeah this one is uh, supposed to have a STH version of it with the rubber wheels I assume that it's using this kind of wheels which uh, like the one that I'm using on my uh, on my CIX like those like Spooky tire something this one yeah didn't see it too much yeah this one I'm just gonna do a short review on this I mean like maybe some of you guys already seen this somewhere yeah you guys can go ahead and also see the review done by Drifter D done he's done a review on uh, on the same exact model except that this one is the STH with the uh, spectre flame green and uh, and the rubber wheels this one is the normal one it's not the RTH it's the normal one people always like uh, misuse concept RTH and STH like if the car is an STH should have an STH then they assume some of them assume that the car is also an RTH but it's not it's not like that in that uh, it's not I mean in that case it's not like that uh, some of the cars uh, it should be like one model should be the STH and the other model should be the RTH vice versa lah. okay so for this one what I can really say is uh, it's a really good model I mean it's not bad I mean yeah I myself I'm a JDM collector so I mean that like, for those you guys who are a JDM collector, I mean you guys gotta have this. Uh, first of all, because it's a it's a JDM and it's a Nissan and also it's a Scania R34. I mean that some of you guys gonna still wait wait for this one. Yeah, yeah. So for this one, is it only has those like two places of decals. First of all, it's on the top. You can see that the car is the decal is like is slightly the decal is slightly off to the right. Yeah, I think this one is the factory error. Yeah, some some of the factory errors. And the head the tail lights and no headlamps in the front. So yeah, anybody who collect this or maybe a perfectionist maybe wants to like uh, paint the headlight or put decals on it I don't know you guys decide you guys do whatever you want to do with your cars man but yeah this one uh, I mean yeah I mean some of you guys are going to flood my comment section with like how the hell you get this where did you get this like how yeah I think this one yeah I know I know I know it's not good uh, to I know it's bad to like promote unreleased items as they say uh, yeah but I just 
let's just say let's let's just say that this car is uh, uh, taken somewhere or taken uh, from the factory by the managers for sampling or stuff I don't know yeah but for those you guys living uh, on from outside of Malaysia you might you guys might have to wait uh, for this for a while uh, for the unreleased one to arrive yeah, so yeah we Malaysian we don't really like to boost or uh, boast about the availability the availability blah blah speak availability of unreleased stuff because it's almost everywhere I guess yeah but I mean I like the color get back back uh, back to the car itself I mean this one is uh, using the I think this one is the well spoke I guess wings yeah with the green I agree like army green something with the black stripes on it and that's why decals at the back you guys can see that puts uh, they put the GTR logo and the Hot Wheels logo as well yeah and the bottom is the same like the old one like the one that they used before this and so there's not much uh, not much to say actually uh, besides that the interior is in black still same so yeah I think it's a great looking car to be honest so I think that's about it short review about the the new uh, Nissan Skylar R34 I means some of you guys are dying to wait for the release of case a somewhere around uh, somewhere around September September on uh, or October I think yeah so I think that's about it for my video as always don't forget to comment comment like and sub at my channel if you guys haven't done so we'll meet again in the next video okay bye